everybody, Sharif here at SS Customs in Redwood City, California. I am bringing to you yet another report. It's been a little while. We've been really busy. I've been busy. We've been doing a lot of building on the back end and we've just been crazy mad with cars. So I uh, want to get right back into recording some content for you guys. We've had a lot of cars run through here since the last time we have talked to you guys about our weekly report. But let's get this going and I'll show you some of the projects that we are working on right now. This project we are doing for one of our good friends. Um, he has been visiting the shop for years. Um, he's one of our disabled friends and he's had this uh, van to get around in. And he's always wanted to try to be a part of our brand, part of, you know, just part of the shop culture. And he stopped by many, many times over the past few years. And this year we decided that we're gonna do some projects to help people and do some really cool projects for wrapping. So we thought who would be better than Noel and his van. So we went ahead and told him, drop off your van and we're gonna do some real cool magic to it. Don't worry about anything, we got it. So uh, he, we ended up doing this whole car wrapped in a Avery Denison, uh, it's called Rising Sun. It's a satin finish. It's an iridescent color shift film. And this color is amazing. It's actually one of the colors I've had on my car in the past had on my E63 wagon and I've always loved it. He loved it back then. He kind of was hinting towards that was the color he wanted. So we went ahead and wrapped the whole car from top to bottom in that, tinted out his tail lights because they were looking a little whooped. And uh, we went ahead and wrapped up a couple other little panel pieces here in satin black to kind of bring them back to life, um, as well as um, uh, uh, tinting, uh, refreshing his headlights, which we got to do a tint on there too to finish it off. There's some yellow marks on the car right now as we going through our final quality control checks. We did a gloss black roof over the whole top to kind of give it a panoramic feel. I think overall, this is a great way for us to kick off our, our, our special project of trying to give back and help people uh, here at a local level and effort. So if you're interested in this program, go ahead and comment. Tell us why we should pick you. Uh, you gotta be in Northern California and uh, why we should pick you to go ahead and do a full makeover on your vehicle, something like this. So go ahead, comment, like, subscribe. As always, those three things you gotta do if you wanna go ahead and get entered in that. So uh, without further ado, I'll walk you through the rest of the shop. Uh, this car right here is from one of our good friends. He uh, has a local restaurant here, Hookah Lounge, and we went ahead and uh, wrapped up his Panamera. We took off the old wrap, uh, wrapped the brand new color, and this car is currently wrapped in a 3M satin dark gray metallic, uh, 2080 series. Uh, color always looks good. It's looking killer on this car. We're gonna refinish the wheels, gloss black or something like that. Uh, car's a little dusty because it's been moving in and out with all the cars we had, but we do have a gloss black roof on there. Car's not done yet. We still got a do door panel to do, a couple other things to do before it's done, uh, but he's super stoked. He keeps coming by and checking up on the wrap, so can't wait to give it to him. Tiago's been killing it on this project. Uh, this Volvo right here, we did a fresh gloss black powder coat on the car. Uh, Fonzo went ahead and tinted out the tail lights in S-Tech's new uh, mid-smoke tail light tint. It is bar none the best stuff we've ever put on a tail light. And the fit finish quality, it looks like it's factory paint or it's like a factory finish that you would get on the tail light tint. And it's protected at the same time. Went ahead and blacked out his emblems too, pretty quick. Uh, and also we tinted out his windows with, uh, what was it, maybe Ceramic, it was a ceramic window tint on this car as well. So he's pretty much good to go for first phase and he's all, we're already thinking of next projects we're gonna do on this Volvo to get it going. Uh, this is one of our other customers, Bill. He's got, he's been bringing us a lot of cars that you've seen on our channel in the past. This is his latest car. It's a brand new Boxster and he's got the, man, I don't even know what color this is, but it's, it's amazing. This is the Miami blue. Oh, this is, this is the Miami blue. Uh, they have so many colors out now and between this line and the Audi line all the time I get mixed up but Miami blue heritage color everybody wants it this car looks great on it it just changes the whole color the whole look of the car this one just full front and PPF polish out the paint ceramic coat and he's out the door it's pretty standard here if you want protective services please contact us we'll take care of you uh, this car is gonna get a ceramic coating um, and it's gonna get finished off I think I think it has come more a little bit more prep work Customers gonna be picking up next week. Pretty easy peasy work right here. Uh, this Maserati we just did for one of our customers, Rebecca. She has 
Uh, the second time around, we're doing some enhanced uh, added features to our car. So we did a um, Maserati style traditional uh, race stripe. And this is in a gloss black. This is a cinder spark red on the outside pinstriping. Pretty much starts right here at the mouth and ends all the way at the back. Uh, Cameron went ahead and laid this all out. It's all hand done, hand measured, and it's pretty much on spot when it comes to that. We like doing it that way. So that way everything lines up and is pretty meticulous with everything just kind of going all the way across as close to as a factory spec would have been. Uh, this right here, Chrome Delete for another uh, uh, Tesla Model 3 client. And uh, we did window tints and it's pretty much, this is set, ready to go. He's ready to go and enjoy that. Uh, G-Wagon, one of two that we have here this week. This one's outfitted pretty well. This is one of our clients moving out of state. Um, so we're gonna go ahead and really hook him up and get his whole car dialed in. This is gonna go Nardo gray, pretty much across the whole body. Uh, and we're gonna leave some of the gloss black portions exposed. So uh, get ready to see this makeover happen. It's gonna be really cool, uh, especially with the two-tone thing working on it. And it's got the tough look on there. Uh, this one right here is one of our shop cars, AKA Mickey's cars, AKA the boss's boss, as they always say. And this one is a Stelvio Quadrifoglio. This is what we take to a lot of shows. And it, uh, it's got Avery Dennison's brand new color. Um, and uh, it's basically like a blue to purple. Um, I forget what it's called exactly, but we're gonna do a full video rele release on it soon. They're releasing four colors. This is one of the four in the lineup. And uh, it's the one that we got choosing. And a lot of my cars are purple, as you guys know. So this is gonna really fall into that. It's blue, it's purple, it shifts, but it's not a shift. I think it's really cool. So uh, it looks really good. We're gonna wipe it down, clean it up, reassemble it, ceramic coat it, and then this will be on its way too to be hitting all the local events. This Tesla Model Y is in for a full color change treatment. This is 3M's matte indigo blue. Super cool color. Uh, you could, uh, not something we do often. I've only done it a couple times. Uh, Sean went ahead and laid this one out and uh, this one's looking really, really good. Uh, I think Sean and Orcon. So this one is getting um, uh, almost done. So this one's gonna get probably finished up tomorrow and then the reassembly starts. And I believe that's all this customer had on there. Uh, he is expecting a red bow. So we gotta go ahead and pop a red bow on there and he'll be happy. And again, Fonzo, thanks for killing it on the Stelvio. So we're doing good there. Oh, also there was that Bentley that you just saw uh, that we just delivered for our customer, the Bitcoin Bentley. So that's, that's gotta be first for us to see a car roll through like that. Uh, but it is a new era, it's a new age, that's how people are doing things. Uh, maybe if you got some Bitcoin or you wanna spend some Bitcoin here, we'll take it. But uh, thank you again for checking us out here at SS Customs. Make sure to like, comment, subscribe. If you think you'd be a good candidate for our, uh, essentially our new build series that we're gonna do a couple times, maybe at least one time a year, where we pick somebody lucky out there who deserves us to go ahead and do a makeover on their car. Go ahead, like, comment, subscribe. As always, thank you guys for checking us out here at SS Customs. Deuces.